you know, we live in a time now in, in the kingdom of God where there's there's so much of ruckus behind who's who's your daddy, yeah, uh, who's your spiritual father, you know, and uh, people are making it so hard. You have you have uh, spiritual heads that are making it so hard for spiritual children. There's so many demands that they're putting on spiritual children. When at the end of the day, people just want to be loved and supported. I think we we must relook at the fathering spirit, and I think if we was to look at the natural fathers and understand their roles in the family, we better understand our positions as spiritual fathers. People want to know that 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 they're counted. They want to know their worth. They want to know their their value. One thing about apostolic fathers, they give identity. And then they know how to speak into your life and, and, and activate you. You know, it's a very, very, very um, important thing. And I think nowadays we're going to have to begin to relook at what we've done to this whole message on fathering. Stop placing so many demands on children and begin to embrace the greatness that's on the inside of it. God has placed greatness on the inside of every believer. And it takes a real father to see the greatness that's in a son or a daughter. God bless you.